Hello everyone, welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. Well, it was quite a journey. It took Tatai about 30 minutes, well, more like 45 minutes, of going here and there and everywhere. But we finally found Mr. Oxturo here, and he's got some chickens that uh, might be interested in. And uh, we might try to talk him into some kind of a, a swap or a trade to see if he's interested, because you know we're, pa we're cash poor. Um, I saw some of the hens that he's got on the way in, and they're the they're definitely the, the breed that I'm looking for. Like that girl right there, uh, and he had some black ones too. Do, do you have uh, only your hens hatch, or do you have incubator? I have an incubator. You have an incubator? Uh, sometimes I did not use uh, because the the hens. I mean the the current is not stable. And ah, it sometimes okay. run out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not good. Yeah, you have to One have. One day run out, it's not dead, good. done. Yeah, eggs. yeah. You have to have 21 days, no brown yes. out. Yes, it should be <laughs> straight. Yeah. 21 days. I bought. Well, I had an inverter battery for backup. No. Uh, that's what I got. But uh, I, sometimes I use incubator if uh, sometimes the the hatch not uh, continue or I mean the hatch not in one day. It, sometimes it yeah you four take days. you take from the nest. The, uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. the the hen is go outside. She's leaving. Yeah, yeah. And some eggs are with two or three. Left. She, uh, she she yeah. take two or three and leave. Yeah. I put in incubator. Yeah. It's just. Five days, three days, hmm. will hatch. Some are not. Some not, but some will. Uh, well, this is quite a setup you got here. Do you sell many? Um, for now I am still um. Still just starting. Starting. Just beginning now. What's your goal? How many uh, do you want? Uh, for now maybe a. I would like to. Uh, to produce here in the Taliban. Mm -hmm. Just first, uh, just only uh, my uh, main shirt. So shirt maybe goal. 50 hens? I, uh, 100 hens? I have already 26 hens. You have 26? Yes, but for now, uh, I'm just steady that. Steady at that, yeah. Because if it's too, too many hens, then I have only small cages, then. Right. So I normally, cannot. what do you sell? Uh, you sell per kilo or per kilo. Mata mata. Per, per kilo. kilo. So what's your price per kilo? Just only one eighty. One eighty. Oh, it's very cheap now. You, uh, before it was two twenty, two thirty, two forty. Yeah. When I came, then I see the the ceiling native chicken. Yeah. That's two hundred to two twenty per kilo. Yeah. And I saw one year ago, 220. <laughs> yes. No, uh, and, my purpose is to... And when the man come with the tricycle, he had native chicken. It may be 20 pieces, 25 pieces. It was like a stampede. <laughs> they run, they run, and they, they're all fighting. Nah. <laughs> and he sold all his chickens in like five minutes, all gone. But that was like a year ago, so I don't know how it is now. But So do you vaccinate? Uh, I have an immunized, immunized, immunization. Which, for which one? Do you use the B1B1? Uh, no, B1. The B1? Yeah. Oh. I think, I think. After the hatch, mm. I immunize so that mm. you will not just... Uh, they, don't, the, they don't get disease, the, the uh, lung disease? Yeah. yeah. Well, that's good. All right, well, we're going to get down to business here and see if we can make some kind of a deal. And uh, we'll, I'll keep you posted. <laughs> yes. That's the main guy? The main guy. Well, we weren't able to strike a deal with uh, Ferdinand here because uh, he drives a hard bargain. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not it. He just, he's like everybody else. He, need, he needs cash, just like we would need cash. Um, so we weren't able to make a trade, but we uh, we traded some information. Uh, we shared some information with each other. Uh, he also has a couple little Zola pits there that he's supplementing his feed with, and because uh, you have to, you just can't hardly do it without it. Sack feed is too expensive. 
So he's got a nice little operation here, and he's thinking about starting up a YouTube channel. And I uh, might give him a few little tips on that if he's really interested into it, in it. Um, but we're going to get home before it gets dark. And uh, we struck out this time, but there's always tomorrow. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. <laughs>